Good morning. I really didn't want to get out of bed today. And I didn't go into the studio straight away today because I'm going to the secret cafe. Cook organic. I'm sticking in Wi-Fi there today. Unofficial Cradle Point users. So today we're installing uh, a Cradle Point PHS 300 at the Secret Kitchen. Marsha has bought uh, the mobile broadband dongle because it's got HSPA, also a ready to go SIM. So, when did you make that this morning? That's freshly made this morning, and that is a chocolate and orange flapjack. Tomorrow we've got an almond and lemon cake. It's a chocolate chai cake. And someone missed it last week, so they've asked I'd made it again, and that got completely warped. And I've gone down to three days a week now, Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, and I said I thought I could get the same amount of custom in three days, and actually that's been the case, it's been just as busy. Might need another <laughs> bit, probably the outside bit will be ready. So, the secret cafe in Stenton is this space that is open three times a week, and from, I think it's half nine till half two. Yeah. 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 That's amazing. So tell people about that pate. Basically it's homemade pate and people think it's very difficult but it isn't. I'm probably doing myself out of a bit of business here. <laughs> Basically it's a roasted mushroom one so I roast the mushrooms in the oven with lots of um, black pepper, white pepper, white pepper's the key, yeah. salt and uh, onion garlic and when it's all cooled down whiz it up um, and then stir it through with fresh chives and cream cheese and that's it and then you pack it down and leave it overnight so it sort of solidifies basically um, i've collected loads of different types of crockery from all over the place lots of charity shops and ebay and booties and junk places some people have donated these are uh, magic city port merion and they're really expensive these are uh, meekin there's quite a lot of um, pool, pool pottery and other bits and pieces. But I mix it in so that people can often be having a two quid bowl out of soup with a bowl that costs 15 quid. Things should be used and that's why I've got all secondhand stuff because I don't want to buy everything new. It's nice because it makes people look at what they're eating off. And I think it just adds a bit of interest to the experience. Three quid. Three quid lunch there. Carrot, apple, cabbage, chives, all sorts of bits and bowls. You've got some tomato couscous, wholemeal bread and a bit of homemade mushroom pate. Three quid. 